With Face Filter Studio, you can turn frowns into smiles, vanish wrinkles, create fake tans, and smooth blemished skin. Let's try it. The first thing to do is open a picture by clicking the folder icon. Let's choose this one. The next thing you need to do with any photo in Face Filter is define the facial area. Click the Select Face button and then draw a box around the face. Her head is tilted, so we'll need to rotate the box a bit. We can also resize the box and move it around by dragging. You want to end up with a box that fits tightly around the face. That looks good. Before we move on, take a look at the other tools on this screen. You can adjust color, balance and exposure, and fix red eye. You can also zoom in to see more detail. Now let's move to the next step by clicking the mask button. Just three more steps to go before we can print. This step is easy. First define the eyes and the mouth by clicking the four points indicated by the flashing markers at left. Now move the other markers a bit to get things perfect. Finally, define the skin area by dragging the yellow line. Hover the mouse just outside the line, then drag to scale it. Okay, now that the face is defined, we can start having fun. Let's move to the next step. Here's where we can do things like change eye color and filter skin. To touch up small skin problems like this mole, use the paintbrush. First, let's zoom in so we can see it better, then click the eyedropper and select a skin color right next to the mole. Then click the paintbrush and touch up the mole. We'll increase the opacity a little to cover it better. To smooth her whole face and get rid of the wrinkles, use the Filter Skin button at right. Watch what happens to her skin as we click Smooth. She looks much younger. Let's increase the smoothing a little more and also give her a fake tan with the Suntan button. Finally, save the results by clicking Apply. Now let's move on to the Expression Filter. This is where things get amazing. Here you'll see a list of expressions on the right. Click the button at the lower right to get a preview. Let's try a few. Here's a confident face, a young face, and a smiling face. There are also some fun expressions like angry and sad, and you can also tweak her expression manually if you like. Okay, we're done. It's time to print the finished photo. You can see the before and after by clicking the original picture box on and off. You can also crop the image with the crop tool. Now click the print button and we're all done. Here she is again. Try face filter on your own photos.